Hi guys, so there was just a fire alarm, but it sounded a little bit different than it normally sounds. So I thought it was like a tornado alarm or an earthquake alarm. I was like freaking out. I was running around trying to find my cat. It was just a fire alarm and it was a false alarm. But anyway, today I have my December favorites and I haven't done a favorites video in a couple months. So I definitely have quite a few favorites. The first of which I'm wearing on my lips right now. It's a combination of MAC Burgundy Lip Pencil with one of two lipstick colors over it. I've been switching it up this month. This one is MAC Spice It Up. This is what I'm wearing right now with Burgundy Lip Liner. It's a really dark red. The other one I've been wearing a lot this month is MAC Fresh Moroccan, which looks like this. They're very similar, but they are a different finish. Fresh Moroccan is a frost and Spice It Up is a luster. Spice It Up is a lot smoother. It's also a slightly darker color, whereas Fresh Moroccan has like a little bit more of a grainy finish. Both of these lipsticks are available on MAC's website. I checked for you guys because I didn't know if they were from limited edition collections and I didn't want to like favorite a product that you guys weren't going to be able to get. So both of these were available like when I filmed this video. My next favorite is Abercrombie 8 Perfume. I've had this since I was so young. This is my second bottle, but I love it. It just reminds me of high school. I really like it and especially at this time of year I must have gotten it for Christmas back then because it kind of reminds me of Christmas time so I've been wearing it every day it's like my go-to perfume of the moment and it kind of brings me back to high school every time I wear it the next two products are kind of bronzy products that I definitely need in the winter because I'm as white as a vampire but the first one is called Sublime Glow by L'Oreal. I've mentioned this in videos. It's been a favorite for years and years and years, but I've been using it again because it's, I'm pale. This is my favorite of the drugstore build a tan daily moisturizers. The next one is by Body Shop and it's the Honey Bronze Brilliance Powder. Looks like this. It's one of those where this pops down or it pops up when you close it. And then it pops down. I don't know. Anyway, it's like a little brush and you shake the powder out and you apply it. And it's like a shimmery bronzy powder for your face. I'll put some on. Put some on my cheeks. And I like it. It's a little glittery. I don't know if you can see. I had one of these once from Lancome, but it actually had like a button you pressed on the end that like put the powder out. This one I think you just shake. That's what I've been doing. Now I'm all like nice and glowy. I have two candle favorites. The first one is by Candles by Victoria, and this is the Three Wise Men. If you watch my winter candle haul, this is the one that I say smells like lush. When I burn this, my bedroom smells like the lush store. The other one's also from my winter haul. This is the Bath and Body Works Merry Mistletoe. I love this one as well. It smells so good. This is the one that's supposed to smell like frosted cranberries, blue spruce, and ice citrus which sounds like a really strange combination, but it does smell really Christmassy. It has that Christmas tree kind of smell to it, and I really like it. My next favorite is my Revlon Lip Butter in Cotton Candy. This I actually have been using as lip color on days that I don't really feel like doing my makeup. It's a really soft pink. I can't put it on right now because you won't even be able to see it, but it does give a good color, and it's really moisturizing. It's not as moisturizing as my Kors Lip Butters, but the Kors Lip Butters also don't give any color, so... It's a nice lipstick that I throw, or lip butter that I throw in my bag, and it kind of gives me color throughout the day if I'm not really wearing much makeup. My next favorite is something I've never talked about in a video, but I love it, and it would be perfect to throw in your bag for New Year's Eve. It's called the Kissing Elixir, and it's in this beautiful robin's egg blue container with a gold lid. It's really pretty, and it is a mint vanilla 100% natural breath spray. Very minty, but it kind of has this like soft vanilla kind of thing to it too. I have a couple of drink favorites for this month. The first one is the Aveda Comforting Tea, which is like a peppermint herbal tea that I love for before bed. This has replaced my sleepy time tea. I think it tastes so good. My second drink favorite is my favoritest drink favorite since I started drinking it a couple months ago. And it is the Donut Shop Coffee for the Keurig. I got this at Target, but I think you can get it at lots of different places. This is my favorite coffee that I've been drinking. I use Pure Via in it, which is a type of stevia, and then some almond milk, and it tastes so good. It comes in little, you know, Keurig pots. And I also have it in decaf because sometimes I drink it at night, but I don't want the caffeine because I just love it. And then my very last favorite for the month, which you guys probably are expecting to see this if you are subscribed to my second channel and are watching my Vintage Glit series, my Diana Plus camera that I have been obsessed with. I've been taking pictures all month. Really since I've gotten this, I've just been in love with it. I've taken pictures every single day since I got it. And I have an entire series on my second channel dedicated to this camera. 
well dedicated to photography in general but this is the camera that I started with. I almost forgot but this is a favorite as well. One of our cell phone cases from the Ellen Blair by Solaris winter collection. I love this one. It has like little silver studs. So I really like that. I thought it was really cute. And loving this ring that I'm wearing today. It is from Free People and I think it's gorgeous. It has like a red stone with some rhinestones around it. And I just thought it was so pretty. I think it was like $20 maybe and I've been wearing it a lot lately. And I think especially when I have red lips on, it's just like a nice red accent color. I just think it's so cute. So those are my favorites for December slash winter favorites slash, yeah, I haven't done a favorites video in a couple of months. So it was like the last couple of months favorites videos. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys later. Bye.